Please welcome this week's special guest, Rod. So, uh, Barry, first of all, what is Rod to you? Uh, this is Rod. He drives my favourite bus, and whenever I see it, I shout, Hello, darling! <laughs> Sue, how do you know Rod? This is lovely Rod, who's my local butcher, and when I won Maestro, he had a whole pig in the window and he stuck my face on its face and he put a little conducting bat on in its trotters to celebrate. Oh. <laughs> and uh, finally, Lee, your relationship with Rod? This is Rod, and after we accidentally took each other's baggage from the carousel, I ended up having to wear his clothes for three days on holiday. <laughs> So there we have it. Uh, Barry's bus driver, Sue's creative butcher, or Lee's unlucky holiday goer. David, off we go. So your local butcher. Yes. You got to know him quite well before this, before you were sort of represented in, yes. in pig form. For about about seven years, off and on. And is, it, is this like a posh butcher's, basically? Well, no. How, how, what do you mean, my posh Well, butcher? I basically think going to a butcher's is quite posh. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> on the basis that most people buy meat at supermarkets, don't they? Well, no, he, the, the butcher's en route to the tube, so I've always gone... And if you need some meat to gnaw on the tube... tube. <laughs> yes, where you Basically, it's on that route, so I always say hello, and there's three of them that work there, uh, right. of which Rod's one. And also, I've got dogs, so they always give me bones for the dogs. Quite so this a... is sort of a 1950s idiot. Yeah, you're exactly, yeah. exactly, yeah. sir. Sue, <laughs> this, was, this was done, uh, your, your, so you say, in honour of the programme Maestro. Yeah. Now, just tell us what that this was. This is a programme um, where you learn how to be a con an orchestral conductor. And so where did they hit the leap going, ah, a orchestral conductor? A pig. But to be fair, when you say why on a pig, I mean he's a butcher. He's not. Yeah, he's not, exactly. He can't That's say, his Should we put it on the face of the pig or the dead body of Andre <laughs> Previn? <Previnier? laughs> How was your face done? Was it uh, like a colour printout? Yeah, like something they've got off off the internet. So it's quite it's quite pixelated. Not pixelated. I think you mean low <laughs> resolution. That's what I mean. <laughs> Otherwise, it would face. be people yeah. would just sort of go, oh, "That's clearly <laughs> the pixelated face of Sue Perkins on there." <laughs> Moving on to what number bus is it, Barry? H14, Hatch End to Norfolk Park Hospital. Right. And, and in reverse. <laughs> no, he doesn't drive in reverse. <laughs> and I don't shout hello, darling, at Rod, and nothing personal, Rod. I shout it at the bus really? because, because it's my friend. Um, you shout it when the H14 drives past. So when, when you're planning to get on it, Yes. Then at what point do you shout, hello, darling? <laughs> I'm a creature of whim. <laughs> <Right>. <laughs> it might be early, it might be late, it might be when I'm getting on. I don't... Yeah. I want to vary it. Do you add, I'm coming in, darling? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> no, there's no foreplay. Uh, <laughs> right, well... David, what about, uh, what about Lee's hmm. play? <laughs> so where were you going on holiday? Thailand. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Me and Rod have got our bags mixed up on the carousel, and so as a result of that, I had to wear his clothes for three days. Where did you fly to? Bangkok? Flo flew to Bangkok, yeah. Right. You didn't have proper labels on your case? Absolutely correct. Well, that was very remiss. Well, it was a remiss. Ooh. It was, a, it was again. remiss, or I'm lying. Aye. Oh, yeah. In which case, it wasn't remiss. OK. <laughs> <laughs> So, I think so let, just, just to clarify, Lee, are you still saying this is true? Or has the, has the very suggestion that you might be remiss made you abandon not, any no. attempt at playing this I game? I will not be... I'm not going to be called remiss! OK, it's nonsense! It's nonsense! I'm not a fool! I actually label my luggage very carefully! I think that's very important, but I'm not for a moment going to pretend otherwise! <laughs> What sort of case? Was it your star? What, what kind of case was it? It was actually leopard skin. <laughs> oh, <laughs> not, not leopard skin, as in that was yeah, the, yeah, it was plastic, case. but he had the... Had the really? No, blocks don't have leopard skin. You're right. Skin. No, it's my wife. My wife's... So Rod's idea. a proper bloke. I mean, you, I oh, could so believe... Am I, no, Thank I you could very believe... Much. No, I know, but you're kind of showbiz and I could believe you had a leopard skin. showbiz. How about I am showbiz? <laughs> <laughs> Rod, Remiss, have... kind of showbiz. <laughs> I'm really coming for you. Oh. <laughs> Not for the man. What, what? <laughs> Hang on, so, no. there are two men, two men of exact same build, uh, <laughs> both travelling to Bangkok on the same flight with leopard skin suitcases. <laughs> <laughs> 
people swap bags all the time, right? Do but they? they bring them back to the airport, <laughs> or they get somebody at the hotel to bring them back to the airport, and they buy replacement clothes. That's they right. don't go, I will now assume the identity. <laughs> <laughs> So it's the rules of the game. I didn't. I wasn't in Bangkok. I had to fly again from Bangkok to a place called Krabi, and then we got on a boat to a, a, an island resort. Yeah. So it was a long way back to Bangkok. So you point. didn't open your case until you got to your final destination. Yes. What were Rod's clothes like? Were you happy to wear them, and did they fit you, and were they okay? I think you can look at Rod. You can see he's a stylish man. Mm -hmm. he's, uh, he's, he's, he's his wigs weren't great, but his. Uh, <laughs> Let's say some of the things I, I wouldn't have worn. For example, his, his bus conductor's outfit. <laughs> <laughs> and that's for his butcher's outfit. <laughs> what are you thinking, David? I mean, it's um, it's a tricky one, I think, this week. <laughs> I think it's I think it's Sue. Really? Yeah. So I think it's probably Sue. But Do you? I... I think it's Lee. You think it's you think Lee? It's Lee? <laughs> Two against one, you should go for We're going to go for yeah. OK, we'll, we'll think we're it's Sue. Sue. Yeah. Right, yeah. Rod, would you please reveal your true identity? I'm Rod, and I'm Barry's H14 driver. <laughs> <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Rod. Yay!